spot for you here, Arthur. Hello, Mr. Morgan. Reverend. Where the hell are we eating, Fato? Come, have a seat, Morgan. We're discussing ladies' bloomers. <laughs> How are you? Fine. Hey, do you think... Do you worry? Do you worry that maybe we've lost our way? How do you mean? <sighs> Ignore that. I won't pretend ignorance. I know just what you mean. <sighs> Come on, boy. I don't know. Things seem bad. The world is changing. And I'm not making much sense, am I? <laughs> no. But somehow, yeah. there, boy. summarize how I feel. Out of here. All it, it right, seems don't get all worked then, It seems the same as always, and then it, it seems yeah. like there's just no other way, and I, I just... We got out of worse situations Idiot. than this. We've done plenty of bad things that we've all forgotten about. Yep. So, feeling better? How's the scar? I heal pretty fast. Lucky you. So you just lazing about, or you got any leads? I got something. You see them? Sure. Well, you see yourself as a shepherd now? <laughs> Maybe. Come on. Well, where exactly are we going? Collect something. Help us get some sheep. Uh, you know, that attempt to seem all enigmatic and interesting, 
That might work for Dutch, but for you, it just makes you look stupid. Come along. You'll see. That train job was a start, but we need more money. Until we can get back to Blackwater and collect. I'm here to tell you. We try to collect that money anytime soon, it'll come with a noose. I was worried you'd say that. Dutch says that we... Dutch says a lot. That's his gift. Saying things. Oh, yeah? What do you mean by that? I was a prize pony once. Now I'm a workhorse. Listen, Dutch is... But... But, well, you was at that thing in Blackwater. We already seen Pinkerton's here. New century's coming. This life, this way, well, we're the last, I reckon. And we ain't long for it. Then that's the way it goes, I guess. For me, yes. All right. So where are we going? Just need to pick up something. There's a hitching post over there. Tether the horse and I'll meet you across the street. Hello? Uh, I already don't like how this is going. Gun store? Yep. Can you, uh, head in, pick up a sniper rifle? I'll explain later. Don't you wear yourself out now. Oh, well, hello again. How can I help you today? Looking for a rifle? Something with a sight on it. Shouldn't be a problem. You want to see what we've got? It's all in the catalog here.
Sure. Let's go. Why couldn't you have done that? Done what? Bought that gun. I had a run in with that fella earlier. We ain't on the best of terms. You had a run in. I've had a run in with half that town. Calm down. It's done now, ain't it? Why are you being so cagey about all this? Always playing some goddamn game. Me? I ain't the one taking Jack on fishing trips. No, you ain't. If you say the boy ain't yours, what's the difference? You probably only run off again. Why are you so interested in my life? Ain't you got one of your own? Just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once, that's all I'm saying. It ain't that simple. You know that as well as anyone. Same as with you and that girl... What was her name? Mary? That was different. No, it ain't. Just the same. Anyway, for the love of God, will you tell me what you got me doing here before I turn around and hit the breeze? There's a herd of sheep coming down to auction from Emerald Ranch. Folk in town were saying the owner's trying to stamp out every farm from here to Ansburg. Yeah, I know that place. All right, but a couple of new ranch hands will be collected on the sale. Doubt the town will care to notice too much. Why we need this rifle you couldn't buy yourself. Reckon we shouldn't get too close. At least not till we know what we're dealing with. Let's see what we can see from up here. them over there. The one now? Put a shot in near them. I reckon they'll hightail it. They're only branch hands. Just watch the sheep. <laughs> Looks like one of them don't scare too easy. Put another shot in close. He'll get the message. That ought to do it. All right, let's go round him up. Let's go, boy. Let's go get the strays. You ever work on a ranch, Marston? No. You? Oh, day here, there, but not much. Most cowboys I know were dumb as trees. How hard could it be? I guess we'll soon find out. Let's get these things, bring them back to the yards.
pretty scattered. Let's get them all rounded up. You know what? Marston, why don't you leave the sheep to me? You ride Shank, keep watch for any trouble. I brought you in on this. It'll be quicker this way. Trust me. This ain't the right time for you to be learning how to hurt. All right, whatever you say. I'm done arguing. Valentine is right around that mountain. Okay. Like I said, I'll handle this. Those are up, boys. There you go. Fine sheep. They're okay. Oh, you seem better around here? I've seen ones with less ambiguity about their provenance. <laughs> A lot less. What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say you give me 25% kickback, and I won't say nothing to nobody. Everything all right here? Excuse me? Sure. I'll excuse you. 25%. Do you want me to put another hole in your head? Folks swing for rustling livestock. 25%. 15. 20. 18. Done. Calm yourself, friend. Just think of it as I'm buying your sins. Nah, you're buying. But we're paying. Go on now. Come back after the auction. You'll get your money. Dutch is waiting for us at the saloon. He is? Eighteen percent. 
thought we was doing the robbing here. Still good money. Thanks for all the help with this. Can't herd, can't swim. Give it a rest, will you? We ain't kids no more. No, never really was. Whoa. Watch it. Sunshine, I'll buy you a whiskey. Are you coming then? Okay there, boy. Not everything, but After in the you, end, sir. I don't believe in absolutes, just shades of gray. Compromises. Compromises. Well, I have never been a man for compromising. I fear it might. Uh, gentlemen. Dutch, Nebo. Where have you been? Working. Marston's thing. Good. And? We're just waiting to get some pay on... Um, a few sheep. Leopold, my good friend, as long as you're here, why don't you and John go make sure there ain't no funny business? Of course. Gentlemen. Drink? Sure. <clears throat> Nothing like talking to old Strauss to make you want to blow your own brains out. I should have left him where I found him all those years ago, bookish little Austrian, fresh off the boat, his eyes out on stalks. Well. I guess the Dutch Vanderlyn finishing school has some strange graduates. That it does. To your good health. Thank you. Vanderlyn! Get out here! Get out what here the now! <sighs> Vanderlyn! You don't know me, but you keep robbing me! My name is Leviticus Cornwall! I am not a man to be messed with by the likes of you! Get out here before I have these men killed! What do you think? Get out here, well, I... you depraved piece of trash! You start spinning a yarn, and when I think the moment's you right, I'll make a move. I got where I am by letting Scott Why not? you rob from me? Vandalin, you're done! Now get out here now! Deal with this nonsense. Please, gentlemen, this is a terrible mistake. This is a case of mistaken identity. What is worse than admonishing a man for the sins of another? Who wants to be the Messiah? Not me, nor do I want to be this Dutch Vanderlyn, whomever he is. Who wants to be the Messiah? Not me. Nor do I want to be this.
cover us! God will push the wagon! Arthur, shoot someone! I'm trying! Get behind the wagon as we push, Arthur! You can use it as cover! Cover us! John will push the wagon. Arthur, shoot someone! I'm trying! Get behind the wagon as we push ah! You can use it as cover! Come on! What the hell are you doing? You make sure nobody's following us. We'll get back to camp. We're gonna gather the troops and get them to start packing up. Ugh. Sure. We can't stick around after this. Let's go! <laughs>
going after that horse. Good work, pal.